Hello everyone, my name is Luis, also known as LG65, and let's play Yakuza 5 Continues. In the last episode, well, we've uh, helped out a stubborn old guy in front of the... Well, Ron, where Sudahashi Fugetsu is, it turns out he was the CEO of another restaurant. I think it was uh, Koshikatsu Daruma. And also we trained with Saigo through a rough and tough chase battle, which almost ended up with Akiyama getting tired. Um, but thankfully, I went to a restaurant just before I started to clip up, and, you know, we did stuff. Anyway, but this time, we're actually going to speak to this high school girl, because something's up with her. Um, excuse me, but are you, um, uh, Mr. Bad Boy? Hmm? Mr. Bad Boy? Now what's that all about? Oh, so sorry, I thought you were someone else. Sure, listen, are you meeting someone? Since you don't know what the guy looks like, I'm guessing he's someone you met online on some hookup site. I thought I recognized the uniform. She must go to the same school as Haruka. That uniform? Which school is it from? It's a local high school, right? I'm sorry, but can you stop prying? <laughs> Oops. Uh, sorry about that. It's not my business. My bad. Hey, did I keep you waiting, sugar buns? You're Kazumi, am I right? Uh, yes. Yes, I am. Are you Mr. Bad Boy? In person and in the flesh, baby doll. I see you uh, did like I asked and came in uniform. But look at you. You're a real doll. I approve. Let's not dawdle. I need to get a much closer look at you. Um, but I don't. What's wrong, baby doll? You want the money, don't you? Come along now. Um, yeah, yes. So that's what they call a subsidized relationship? The guy's headed straight to a love hotel, I bet. There's a love hotel at the south end of Shofukuchu. Dang it, I've seen too much to stay out of this. Yeah, well, before we can do that, or actually, we're lucky, because the guy was an idiot enough to try to run to another way, but no. Well, at least he caught up to me. Hoo hoo hoo! Oh hey, how about this? Oh no. Okay. Oh my god. Get off! Okay, I saw another item here. Can I pick it up? <laughs> okay. Oops. Okay, there we go. Oh. Hold on a minute. I see a beer bottle here. Well, not much to do about that one. Toriner Double Plus. I'm getting more of those, aren't I? Anyway, so we've learned that the she's off to a love hotel along with the guy. So I better get down there quickly. Oh boy. Oh, not Bubby. Okay, here we go. Beautiful. Oh ho uh, I wanted to do a combo, but instead I got the I get the double juggle. Beautiful. Wooden katana. Uh, yeah, there we go. I think I'm in the right spot. Whoa. I think it's a different sub-story sub coming up here. Oh, I'm so sorry. I wasn't watching where I was going. Are you okay? Uh, yeah. I'm fine. What about you? Are you alright? You took the worst of it. Yes, I'm fine. It's just that I'm in a hurry. Oh, sure. Go ahead. You don't have to worry about me. I'm so sorry. I have to go. 
There's a girl in a rush. I wonder what's going on. Phone call? Hello? Hi, it's Yamaura. Akiyama-san? I was wondering, do you have time now? I guess so. What's up? Sorry to drop this out you out of the blue, but can you go to Ashitabo Park right now? Why? A talent, a girl, got lost, so I told her to go there and wait. Her name's Strawberry Maya. Her agency's pushing her hard now. You know her? No, I don't. I suppose not. Her agency's small. My bad, but it slipped my mind completely that we're just looking after her just for today. See, her manager's getting married today. Since our agency's friendly with them, we agreed to look after Maya for a day. Stupid me. I forgot all about it, and our schedule book's solid. So, you're expecting me to pick up the slack? Bingo! I'm glad you're so quick to catch on. There's no one else we can turn to. I mean, you run your own company, right? Surely you can be a talent manager for a day. Actually, I let my secretary handle that kind of stuff. Pretty much everything, really. It'll be okay. If anyone can do it, you can do it. I'm counting on you, Akiyama-san. I don't know. What does being a talent manager entail, anyway? My schedule is already set for today. You're pretty much just her chaperone. Oh, also, Maya's promoted as naturally perky, quirky girl, so try to keep her in character. Hmm? Huh? What do you mean by that? Maya's actually a timid and proper kind of girl, but they're pushing her as a silly character. Why would they make a girl like that adopt that kind of persona? Uh, I don't know. It wasn't my call. So, Akiyama, huh? Can you do this for me? I could really use you, sir, help. Alright. You owe me one, Yamaura. You're a lifesaver. Thank you kindly. Okay, I'll explain Maya's schedule. Listen closely now. First, meet with Maya at Ashitabo Park and bring her to Dinah Chair for a magazine interview. Next, take her to Sultan TV for her Love to See You Smile studio taping. And then finally, she's to appear on Sultan Borny Love Check Quiz, also at Sultan TV. Got it? Don't forget the order. Magazine interview, Love to See You Smile, and Sultan Borny Love Check Quiz, right? Perfect! I knew I could count on you! It's all you! Akiyama-ha! Bye! Okay, first I have to find our Strawberry Maya at Ashitawa Park. But we're actually not doing that right now. Um, because, if you remember, I'm actually in the middle of a sub-story. And I was hoping it was actually, you know, of the... What's it called? And I was hoping it was actually at this point. But guess what? I It was not there. So that's my fault too. Um, I'm kind of am. <laughs> I guess Akiyama is not exactly ready. Ah, this is the spot where um, the Gandahara video um, store used to be in Yakuza 0. Come on, baby doll. Quit stalling. Yeah. No, I don't want to. There's that subsidized relationship couple. Well, we're in this deep, so let's get after it. Come on, Kazumi, what's your problem? You can't back out now. Yeah, please, I don't want to after all. I want to go home, please. Now hold on, you're being unreasonable. I went through all this trouble coming to see you. Junior here is not about to be blue ball. Hmm? Hey, pal, you're a disgrace. Look at yourself. You actually forced a girl into this place? What? what Who the hell are you? The girl told you no. Dial it down and let her go. You stay out of this! Ain't none of your business! Look, this is a paid relationship deal, isn't it? With a minor, no less. That's grounds for arrest right there, you realize. Sh sh shut your yap! I told you to scram! He's just the one. I don't know why the font says rough looking guys. And that is beautiful. Yikes! So, so sorry! No more, please! 1,000 yen. Are you alright? I imagine you had enough of this paid relationship nonsense. I did do this because I wanted to. I didn't have any choice. Hmm? You had no choice? 
You're really that hard up for money? This isn't about money. Then what? It's... Kazumi, what do you think you're doing? I I Amy! What are you doing losing a customer? We got things to do, you know. So irresponsible of you not to follow through. I get it. These girls were making you do this. But why would you put up with it? Because I don't have any other friends at school. They said they'll ignore me if I don't go on a paid date. Some friends? You'll be much better off without their so-called friendship. But if I refuse, they would bully me at school. They would hit me and cut up my uniform and... Cousin me! How long are you going to talk to that geezer? We got to find us another John. Come on! We're going! If you don't earn enough, how are going to afford to go party? Huh? Did I hear that right? You want Kazumi to sell herself so he can play? This has to be a new love. I'd love to see what kind of parenting results in this. <laughs> Is that right? How about I introduce you to my big brother instead? Hmm? Huh? Hey, what's up, Emmy? Kazumi was going to earn some money today, right? Did you run into some trouble? That geezer's getting in the way. Keep spewing grade school morality bullshit and holding things up. Huh? What's the matter, geezer? You got a problem with my baby sister? Why don't you tell me about it then? Hmm, let me get this straight. You really are Emmy's older brother? <laughs> what, you pissing yourself now? That's what you get you thinking you can boss us around. Mister, you should run. They're capable of anything when they're mad. Run? Why? I'm rather pleased that they came along. The timing's perfect, actually. Huh? Eh? What do you mean? Your little sisters was really getting on my nerves. But I have this thing against hidden women. So I wasn't sh really wasn't sure what to do. But if I don't need to hold back with you fellas, right? That's real funny, geezer. You're not from around these parts, are you? You don't know who you're dealing with. Stop this, geezer! Trying to find Jaws is too much work. We'll just take his wallet after you're done with him. <laughs> well, they were asking for it. Just saying. Let's party. Alright. Let's get off. Hold on a minute. I got I see items there. Ooh, here we go. Oh, of course, I'm gonna keep it with me. Another item. <laughs> well, considering that I had dinner the other night, um, something spicy no less, I don't mind the taste. And a double KO! Oh, mercy! Please, we're sorry! Geezer's not my name. It's Akiyama. Th thank you, Akiyama-san. Thanks to you, I... I feel so stupid for being afraid of those people. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Did that cost you some friends, though? No, it's okay. I was with them only because I was scared of Amy's brother. I'm not gonna have anything to do with them anymore. I'm gonna make the effort to make new friends. That's good. Actually, there's a girl who might fit the bill. I think she attends the same school as you. Pardon? A girl named Sawamura Haruka. You know her? Akiyama-san! You know Sawamura Haruka? <laughs> yeah, you might say. She's so busy with being a pop star, she hasn't had the chance to make many friends at school. If you don't mind, can you say hi to her? She'll be happy, I'm sure. But she's a pop star! Will I really be able to become friends with her? She is a pop star, but she's an ordinary girl your age too. I'm sure she feels lonely at school with so few friends. Oh, I don't didn't think it would be like that. I'll muster my courage and try talking to her. I'd appreciate that. I have to go now. Thank you, Akima-san. 2,000 experience and an automatic level up.
next time in Let's Play Yakuza 5, we're, I think, going to go back to Dinah Chair to help with the investigation onto Mire Park's death. So take care, everyone. And remember, life's good.